we often get people bringing us paintings that require one of two ways to be framed. There are many different ways to frame a painting, but there are primarily two ways to do it in what I consider to be right. Because the image fills the whole canvas, I hesitate to create, to put it into a frame, a more traditional frame, where the frame goes on top of the canvas. That covers a quarter of an inch, because all frames cover a quarter of an inch, of the actual image that's on the canvas. So then what we do is we put it in this kind of a frame, which is a float frame. A float frame is created specifically for this purpose. Its shape is like this, right? So it's meant to accept the artwork inside here. These come deeper, wider, narrower, and the deeper ones are depending on the kind of painting that you have, whether the artist used a thick stretcher or a more narrow stretcher. This particular one is the sample that I actually have in my hand. This is called a floating frame. What happens here is that the painting is inside. It's sufficiently spaced away so, much so that if there's any irregularities, anything is not square or not perfect, your eye won't see it, which is usually a quarter of an inch. We'll make the frame a quarter of an inch bigger so that you see the shadow line all the way around. <laughs>